Hi, this is Derek Wilson with CDO Advisors. I'm going to give you a brief overview of using Auto Model on RapidMiner's new platform where you can take data that you have, load it up to their web based interface, explore your data, build some models, and um, really let you experiment and get an idea of what's possible on the RapidMiner platform uh, with their cloud based solution. So, to do this, I'm going to build a new model. I'm going to upload my data. In this case, I've got the Titanic data set. I'm just going to load that up from an Excel sheet. It's going to go through and tell me I've got 1,309 rows, 14 columns of data. It does some initial analysis of what's out there. And then I have to tell it what I want to predict. In this case, I want to know the likelihood of someone surviving. I'm going to click Next. Now it's going to go through the auto model, understand what's going on in the data, and give me some information. So I've got four columns that have high ID-ness, too many missing values. I don't want to use those in my model. I've got two that are questionable. It's telling me this one's you know, high correlation. Uh, this one's too low of a correlation, also with some missing attributes. And then I can see everything else that it's going to use. So I'm just going to use these selections that it has chosen. Click Next. And I can run, in this case, a decision tree or a generalized linear model. I'm just going to do the decision tree to make this run a little faster. So now it's going to go through. And on the automodel.rapidminer.com platform, it will take the Titanic data, run it through the decision tree, and compute the results and return that here. So now you can see this is the root mean squared error. Uh, it gives me stats down here about how the model works, how long it took to build, if it's finished or if it failed. I can click either here on decision tree or up here on decision tree to see what the actual branches of the tree are and explore the tree. So if your sex was male, and you were over 12 and a half years old, and your passenger class was less than 1.5, and your age was a certain value, right? 2.4%, and there were 25 people in that class. I can check the performance and look at, again, the information that it's providing. So a very quick way to take data that you have that maybe you're not sure what you can or can't do with it if the, the quality's there, or you're not really sure what to do, it gives you a really easy way to check that information out. And likewise, once it's built it, if you're using the RapidMiner platform, you can actually download this process and use it as the basis of a RapidMiner solution by letting the cloud kind of start that journey for you if you're, if you're new to RapidMiner. So take a data set, put it out on AutoModel, try it out, and let me know what you find in your data. Thanks.